the week of May 9th, 2023. My name is Jacob. Welcome back to DSN. U.S. News, May 1st marks the start of Asian American and Pacific Islander Heritage Month. In the United States, it celebrates the achievements and contributions of the AAPI community. The broad term includes 50 ethnic groups. They speak over 100 languages and have roots in more than 40 countries. In world news, on May 6, 2023, King Charles III was officially sworn in as a 62nd monarch of the United Kingdom and 14 other Commonwealth realms. They include Canada, Australia, and New Zealand. This is Britain's first coronation ceremony since Queen Elizabeth II was crowned in 1953. In local news, the Buckeye Pool opens May 27th to celebrate. You can spend the entire day at the pool free of charge. Go to Maverick with This Week in History. This week in history, my name is Maverick. In 1887, the first Buffalo Bills Wild West show opened, treating audience members to an exaggerated view of the American West. The show featured sharpshooters, roping tricks, and reenactments of the historical events. In 1869, the Transcontinental Railroad was completed, finally allowing people to travel from the East Coast to the West Coast by train. Until this time, travelers could go part of the way by train, but had to finish the trek by horseback or wagon. In 1607, 100 colonists arrived to found, to found the first permanent English settlement in the, in the Americas. They called their new home Jamestown. The settlers included Captain John Smith, John Rolfe, and later on Pocahontas, the daughter of a nearby Native American chief. See you next time on This Week in History. Go to Malachi and Rudy with sports. Welcome to sports. My name is Malachi. And I am Rudy. In basketball news, the Phoenix Suns and Denver Nuggets played game four of the second round of the playoffs Sunday night. Tonight is game five. Go Suns! The Diamondbacks are home tonight to take on the Florida Marlins. This weekend, they will play a, a series with the San Francisco Giants. That is all for today. See you next time on Sports News. Let's go to Ellen Brielle's Entertainment News. Welcome to Entertainment News. I'm Ella. And I'm Brielle. When you're making your summer plans, you might want to include a couple of trips to the movie theater. Here are just a few of the movies being released next month. Spider-Man Across the Spider-Verse, Transformers Rise of the Beasts, Disney's Elemental, and Harold and the Purple Crayon. That's all for this week. See you next time on Entertainment News. Let's go to Maverick and Marley with Science Time. Welcome to Science Time. My name is Marley. And I am Maverick. Black holes have incredibly powerful gravitational pulls. They usually gobble everything up around them. However, for the first time, scientists have found a black hole that is creating millions of stars as it zips through space. Curious to know where this light show was coming from, Dockham and his team decided to investigate further. They used the powerful telescopes at one of Hawaii's observatories. To their astonishment, they discovered that the streak was from a 200,000 light, light, light year long train of newborn stars. This is twice the diameter of our Milky Way galaxy. See you next week with more science time. Ellen Braille, Fun Fact Trivia. <laughs> Welcome to Fun Fact Trivia. My name is Ella. And I'm Brielle. Did you know that May 8th starts Teacher Appreciation Week? This week is for honoring teachers and recognizing the lasting contributions they make to our lives. Your question for today is, who persuaded Congress to begin National Teacher Appreciation Week? A. Hillary Clinton. B. Michelle Obama. Or C. Eleanor Roosevelt. You have 10 seconds to make your decision. See Eleanor Roosevelt, you are correct. The National Education Association continued to observe Teacher Day on the first Tuesday in March until 1985 when the National PTA established Teacher Appreciation Week as the first full week of May. How to observe this day? Write a letter showing your support, ask them what they need the most, refill their supplies, or volunteer to show support. See you next time on Fun Fact Trivia. Back over to Maverick with the word of the week.
of the week. My name is Maverick. This week's word is appreciation. Appreciation is a noun and it means a feeling of thanks. Here's how it can be used in a sentence. I wrote my teacher a letter to show, show her my appreciation for everything she does. See you next time on Word of the Week. Thank you, Maverick. That is all for this year's episode of DSN. Let's check out some bloopers. If you said A, 1680s, you are correct. Chocolate milk was invented by Sir Hans Sloan in the 1680s. Fun fact. <laughs> Welcome to Science Time. My name is Marley. And I am Maverick. Florida detected the giant African land snail for a third time. The, what is that word? Invasive. In world news, India works to bring cheetahs back. They are the world's fastest fast pack. In world news, India works to bring cheetahs back. They are the world's fastest animal. They dot out. Dot out. If you said B, 60 million, you are correct. That's a lot of waste. Reducing this number can be achieved with water filtration devices and using portable re, 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 <laughs> the Marley and Maverick with Mar Marley time. Okay, yeah. Welcome to Science Time. My name is Marley. And I am Maverick. On October 5th, NASA astronaut Nicole Mann became the first Native American woman to launch into space. Mann is also the first woman to command a space. <laughs> Over to Mila and Layla with this week's set. Are you gonna read it? Oh. <laughs> over? What? <laughs> Have you ever? Now let's go over to Maverick. Oh, real. That is all for this week's episode of DSN. See you next week. Nope. <laughs> In world news, a 30 year old farm dog has named. Nope. It's the week of February 14th, 2023. My name is Jacob. And I'm Mila. Welcome back to DSN. <laughs> the week of February 14th, 2023. My name is Jacob. And I'm Mila. Welcome back to DSN. <laughs> Mila! Giant species named for Dor <laughs> For DC. Giant species named for for DC. Species <laughs> named for DC. For DC. Fact trivia. My name is L. A. Hillary Clinton. B. Michelle Obama. C. Eleanor Roosevelt. Yeah, ten seconds to make your decision. Let's go over to Molly time. Nope. Now over to Maverick with the weed. On April 19th, 77, 1775. I forgot where I was at. In 1994, a member of the British Parliament. Par that is all for today. See you next time on Sports News. Eh. <laughs>